It is a normal day for this SCP scientist in Site-19. As he is getting a coffee in the break room and preparing for a test on SCP-173, he hears screaming coming from down the hall and gunshots. He immediately is jolted with terror and asks his fellow scientists what is happening. They all do not know and decide to not worry too much about it until a flashing red light and loud alarm fill the room. They all flee from the break room as an announcement of a chaos insurgency raid plays over the intercom. Next thing the scientist knows there are men in all black like mobile task forces, but their patches are different. One of them yells everybody on the ground. As they all get on the ground one steps forward, aims their gun, and says open fire. As gunshots ring everything goes black for the scientist and his colleagues. What we just saw here is the cause of a chaos insurgency raid. In today's video, we will be going over what happened during Site-19's raid, who the Chaos Insurgency are, and why they chose to raid the SCP Foundation. Let us dive into this. The Chaos Insurgency is a group of XMTF. They are a splinter group off of the O5 Council's top secret Red Right Hand Personal Task Force. The Red Right Hand Task Force is a group of some of the best of the best operatives. They do everything the O5 Council need and have access to the highest of security. The reason some of them splintered off is unknown. The Chaos Insurgency will attack the SCP Foundation. During these attacks, they will fight ruthlessly sparing nobody and killing everybody in sight. They will also breach many dangerous Euclid and Keter class SCP. They will also steal and house SCP. They currently have a mini SCP house. These include the Bell of Entropy, an object that can cause destruction and chaos depending on where it's struck. And the Staff of Hermes, an object capable of warping the physical and chemical properties of any matter it touches. The Chaos Insurgency uses these SCP to raid the Foundation and gain money from doing tasks and selling or trading anomalies. The Chaos Insurgency goal is most likely total world domination. As it stands there are four ranks, there is Delta Command, the highest and most powerful rank, next there is Gamma Class, the second highest rank, then there is Beta Class, the second lowest rank, and finally there is Alpha Class. We will now talk about each rank. First we have Alpha Class. Alpha Class members are personnel who are often recruited from people who nearly possess no knowledge of the anomalous world. Most of these personnel joined the insurgency in order to escape from their miserable lives and are considered by the higher ranks as expendable similar to the Foundation's Class D personnel. Next we have the Beta Class. Beta Class are personnel who are under the Gamma Class and carry out orders in the field. Think of them as low-level field agents. They are somewhat trained personnel who specialize in carrying out field operations. Then we have the Gamma Class. Gamma class are chaos insurgency researchers and military commanders who oversee the execution of orders given by the command. They are like the ethics comite of chaos insurgency. They manage and oversee the execution of tasks or orders given by Delta Command. Finally, we have Delta Command. Delta Command is a group which orders and oversees the activities of the lower ranks. The engineer is an important member of the command as they are in constant telepathic communication with the engine, a paranormal object that controls almost the entire of the insurgency, although this is up to head cannon. The engineer constantly transcribes a massive list of instructions comprised of plan and steps which are delivered to the insurgents by Delta Command. The engineer and Delta Command appear to be the counterparts of the Foundation's O5 Council and Administrator. Now that we have gone over that you may be wonder who is the engineer and what is the engine. Well, the engineer is like a puppet who carries out and oversees and manages everything for the engine. The engine is a highly classified paranormal telepathic object. The engine is like a puppet master pulling the strings behind the scenes of the chaos insurgency. Now that you have learned about the Chaos Insurgency, go watch one of my other videos. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.